You're welcome to Africa Cross Television Channel. My name is Pastor Salvation Nekoma, the Senior Pastor of God's Blowing Fire Ministry, aka GGFM. Today we are reading from the book of Daniel, chapter 6, verse 3. Then this Daniel was preferred above the presidents and princes because an excellent spirit was in him, and the king thought to set him over the whole realm. Our topic today is rising above others. Rising above others. If you discover, you find out that Daniel was not the only president at, at this time, but he was taken as the best because there was something found in him. Life is in phases. Men are in sizes, but I discover that destiny is turn by turn. When you get to your turn, God will make a name for himself in your life. Now, there are three things I saw that made Daniel to be outstanding over others. Number one is that Daniel was a loner. If you must stand or rise above others, you must be a loner. L-O-N-E-R. In the life of Jacob, in Genesis chapter 32, verse 24, the Bible says, And Jacob was left alone. There he rest stood with an angel. That encounter made him to be outstanding in life. In life. He moved from being Jacob to Israel. That separating himself from the crowd. In 2 Corinthians chapter 6, verse 17, he said, We have for come up from among them and be thou separate. There is need for you to come up from the crowd. There is how you follow the crowd, you may miss your crowd. You cannot be a general, a general in, the, in, the, in the midst of the generality. So you need to come out from the crowd so that you cannot lose your crowd. A wise man said something. He said, those that walk, walk with crowd. Those that run, run with few. But those that fly, fly alone. If you want to be a high flyer, learn how to be alone for self-retreat. If you look at Luke 15, verse 16 and 17, when nobody get to that young man, his senses came back. That's how you follow people, follow others, you will lose the originality that God has made you to be. I'm praying for you that that spirit of retreat that will announce you and launch you into the next level is coming to hit you in the name of Jesus Christ. Matthew 26, verse 36, Jesus got a point. He left his disciples. Even when he took Peter, James, and John, a time came, he left them and went alone. There are people that would like to you know, walk with others. There is nothing by walking with others. There are certain things you withdraw and think about your next level alone. In 2 Corinthians chapter 10 and verse 12, the Bible said, They that compare themselves with themselves, they that measure themselves with themselves are not wise. You need to come out so that you can look forward for your next level. The next thing I saw in Daniel that made him to be outstanding is that Daniel has an excellent spirit. Where we read in verse, in verse, in verse 3, the Bible said, This Daniel was preferred. There's no how you can operate in excellence that you will not be preferred to others if you look at daniel chapter 1 verse 19 and 20 bible said the king found none to be as wise as daniel and his friends they were 10 times better than the magicians and the astrologers in that time so what made them to be outstanding was excellent spirit excellent spirit what is excellence when you begin to do things in an unusual way you don't do it in the common way everybody does it you do it in an unusual way that makes it come out new that makes it come out uncommon i see excellence spirit coming upon you in the name of jesus christ you can't carry holy ghost and will not be excellent you can't carry holy ghost and come out last you can't be the tail you must be the head you can't be the last you must be the first in the name of jesus christ we need holy ghost because it is the spirit of god that makes us to operate in excellence and i see you walking in dominion over others in the name of jesus christ so when the the excellence will oppress in you you do things others cannot do that in others fear to do that in others dares to do that is what we do to be outstanding so as a general you must keep out from the generality 
I see God making you a voice in your family, making you a voice in your environment in the name of Jesus Christ. If you look at Daniel, in Daniel chapter 5, in verse 12, that we are given the quality or the, 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 the credentials of Daniel, the, 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 the CV of Daniel. The Bible said that he has excellent spirit, he has knowledge, he has understanding, he can dissolve doubt, and he can explain hard sentences. These are qualities in Daniel that made him to be outstanding. What do you have that can make you to, ask, to be outstanding above others? Do what others could not do, and the Lord will project you and announce you in the name of Jesus Christ. The third thing I saw in the life of Daniel that made him to be outstanding is knowledge. Knowledge. Because this chapter 4 verse says, my people have perished because of lack of knowledge. When you lack knowledge, nobody will know you in this world. What you know, you control. What you don't know controls you. According to the word, knowledge means what you know will give you an edge over others. So we have to go for knowledge. What is knowledge? The acquisition of facts. If you look at the case of um, Joseph, Joseph moved from dreaming to interpretation of dream. That is what made him to be outstanding in Egypt. So we need knowledge. Psalm, Psalm 19 verse 2, he said, Day unto day uttereth speech. Night unto night showeth knowledge. Night experience is what gives you knowledge. Anything you go through is either for a lesson or for a reason. So don't go through certain situations without learning something. Hallelujah. So knowledge is important. In Isaiah chapter 1 verse 3, God was the one talking. He said, the odds know the owner. They ask, know where the master script. But Israel has not known me. You can imagine the people of God don't know him. What you know, you control. In Isaiah chapter 5 in verse 13, he said, my people have gone for miss for lack of knowledge. He said, their honorable men have gone for miss. So their honorable men have dried because of this for lack of knowledge. Every spirit of ignorance, as you commit amen, God will take it away from your life in the name of Jesus Christ. Anything will take you to acquire knowledge, go for it. What made um, David to be outstanding after killing the bear, killing the lion? It was not that that brought him to the palace. Before that time, he has learned how to play instruments. And when the spirit of the, 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 the evil spirit from God was tormenting Saul, they said, let's look for someone who can play well. David used only sin to cast away devil without and without prophecy, without fasting, without prayer, just an instrument. He was playing it in an excellent way. That thing which you are doing, how do you do it? It's not what you do, it's how you do it. Because how you do it makes you be outstanding in the midst of others. I speak wisdom into your life. I speak knowledge into your life. I speak understanding into your life. I speak the spirit of excellence into your life. You are going to be outstanding in your business. You are going to be outstanding in your family. You are going to be outstanding in your marriage. You are going to be outstanding in your career. And that vocation you are chasing, God will make you to, to be outstanding in the name of Jesus Christ. If you can follow this instruction and follow the steps of Daniel, there is nothing that can stop you. Your foundation can stop you. Your environment can stop you. Your enemies can stop you. Because Daniel and his friends, we are outstanding. Nothing will stop them. And if they, we are able to succeed, you will succeed and you will come out a brighter star in the name of Jesus Christ. I know that this message has blessed you. I want you to subscribe and share make a comment let someone who also need to hear what you have heard hear it and also watch it and get blessed for prayer and counseling you want to represent us in your locality and environment our contact is displayed on your screen reach out to us via that contact keep watching Africa's television channel your life will not remain the same watch out for the next episode like this video and share it your time has come god bless you Thanks for watching. Please do well to like, subscribe, and click on the notification bell, so that you will be notified when we release a new video. Thank you.